Uh, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. In this video, I want to explain how to uh, merge the accounts as well as how to change types of the accounts, right? Uh, for that purpose, click on the list chart of account. Uh, number one, uh, how to merge the accounts. For example, there are two accounts. Let us say, for example, uh, we have two accounts, but the purpose of these two accounts are the same. It means they are doing the same. If they are doing the same, so there is no need to maintain both of them. Let us say, for example, in this case, there are two accounts. One account is by the name of sales discount, and the next one is discount of sales. Uh, if this is so, if, of course, the purpose of these two accounts are the same, so no need to maintain both of them, you can just maintain one of them only, right? So if this is so, you can merge these two accounts. Out of these two accounts, you can have only one of them. But one thing, you have to remember or you have to take in your mind that before merging the account you have to see types of the account should be the same unless types of the accounts are the same you cannot merge it right so this is very important so let us say that we want to merge these two accounts into one of these it then make only one of them or maintain only one of them why we want to merge because sometimes it is it will be bulk of separate accounts but we want to maintain only a so in order to reduce the number of accounts so you can merge the accounts right so it depends on you that you want to merge which account you want to merge let us say for example this time we want to merge this account discount on sales with sales on discount we want to maintain this one but we want to remove this one which one you want to remember just remember that is name for example the name is sales discounts the exact spelling you have to remember which you want which account you want to remove or which account you want to be merged so please select that one so let us say for example we this in this case let us say in this case we want to merge this account we want to merge this one with this one so we want to maintain this one but we want to close or we want to uh, take off this account so any account which you want to take off so please take select that one click edit in the edit so please mention the exact name of the account which you want to maintain it. So what was the exact name? The exact name was sales discount, right? Sales discounts. If I remember the exact name, this was that one. See, when you select on this one, so the QuickBook gave this one. This name is already being used. Would you like to merge this account? Yes. If you want to merge the account, so please click this one. So they give a sound after the sound, so there is no discount on sales only sales discount is available so in this case you can merge several accounts if the type of the accounts are the same so any account which you want to merge so click on that account so click on edit so to which account you want to merge it so please remember name of that one exact name of that one should be mentioned there right so in this case you can merge it and also of course you can uh, we can say change the type of the accounts as well for example let us say there is an account by the name of uh, there should be a zero balance so suppose there is an account by the name of health insurance and type of the account is what expenses account you can click on this one go on the edit you can say that for example after this insurance should not be a coins of expense insurance should be a coins of income you can save to this one you cannot change the type of the sub account yes it must be same type as as it is parent account yes this point is very also important when you when there is a when the account is a sub account you cannot change it to another type of account why because if you want to change it it should be in the same type let us take another one for example there is a is interest but one thing you have to remember that if you want to change the type the balance should be zero basically right so select on this one there is a payroll for example payroll is also zero postage is also zero let us say we want to change the postage we want to change the postage previously let us say postage was a coins of expenses but now the expense should be a coins of income save on this one now the postage is a coins of income it is not a coins of expenses right or and a coins of income can be converted into a, another type of expenses see this is another income another income can be converted into we can say other expenses previously it was a coins of expense now income now it is a coins of income it can be changed right so you can do it but one thing that you should take in your mind let us say for example there's an account by the name of professional fee 
we want to edit this one we want to convert this one into for example account receivable click this one you cannot change an account types from from or to account receivable or account payable you can change the types of the account but unless the account is account payable or we can say account account receivable or account payable it means no account no account can be converted into account payable or account receivable or on the other side account payable and account receivable cannot be converted into other accounts as well let us say there is account receivable if there is any kind of account receivable let us try for that one see this is account payable we want to change the type of this one we want to change so this it is basically inactive you cannot change it let us say there is account receivable we want to change the type of this one can you change it no you cannot change it so account receivable and account payable cannot be changed into other accounts and other accounts as well as cannot be changed into account receivable and as well as account payable right but the rest of the thing is fine so unless it it is a sub account so if it is a sub account it cannot be changed as well so as i said before if it's if it is a sub account you cannot change it uh, why this is so because if you want to change it the type of the account should be like it is parent account for example let us say we want to convert this one right you want to change this one previously it is expenses now we want to convert it into equity it says that you cannot change the type of the sub account it must be the same type as it is parent account so if you want to convert it if you want to convert it so it should be the type of it is parent account it is parent account is expenses so you cannot convert it into other accounts but the parent can be converted let us select the parent itself we want to convert the parent let us say the parent should be a coins of income click on this one you cannot change the the account type of an account with a sub account yes that is the case so if it is a sub if it the account has a sub account also you cannot change it right so you cannot change this one why because they have a sub account you cannot change the sub accounts into another one why because the main account is a coins of expenses right so these are a kinds of limitation but the rest of the things you can do you can delete the account you can merge the account you can edit the accounts well of course you have to remember a few points regarding deleting of the accounts as well you cannot delete the accounts if there is a balance you cannot delete the accounts if account has a sub account let us say we want to delete this account can you delete it no this account has a sub account you cannot delete it you cannot delete the accounts if the account has a balance if the account is used in a particular transaction if account is used in a particular items so in that case you cannot delete the account but you can delete the account if there is a no balance for that one right you can delete this one click on this one you can delete it after this there is no that account so if the account is not used in any case if the account does not have sub, sub, sub account if the account does not have any balance it can be removed it can be edited you can change to any type unless it is account payable or account receivable and as well as you can merge you can merge the accounts if if the type of the accounts are the same so thank you up to